An intense battle of brains, bolts and robots is being waged in San Diego this weekend. 10 News was there live at 8 a.m. as hundreds of high school students from all over the world got ready to face off in the annual first robotics competition at the Valley View Casino Center. 10 News reporter Marie Coronel shows us how the event combines science with sports. Watching this competition, you're really not sure what to make out of it. Is this volleyball, basketball, or a real life video game? And the answer is all of the above. And the interesting part, teenagers are responsible for making this happen. Because you spend six weeks building a robot and you want to bring it and see how it functions. Hundreds of teens representing different schools from all over the world competed in the eighth annual first robotics competition. Out of the 60 teams, 37 are from the San Diego area. From start to finish, the students designed, built and programmed their robots making sure it could throw a yoga ball or even play catch with another robot. Something Eastlake High mentor Joel Faust says isn't something you can learn from a textbook. There's nothing like the hands-on experience of doing, uh, doing robotics. A big part of this hands-on experience is troubleshooting. Just yesterday, Eastlake had a computer malfunction and they had to get everything fixed just in time to get on the playing field. Go, 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 go. Something goes wrong that second and they need to fix it right th then or it's that everything's going to go down. And statistics show there is a need to get kids from California involved in science and math. Last year, California ranked 45th in math and science achievement and it's projected by 2018 at least 80% of the jobs that will be available in California will require computing and engineering skills. From the Valley View Casino Center, Marie Cornell, 10 News. And the winning teams will head to St. Louis next month for the finals.